Cold outreach on Instagram is one of the best ways to get new clients for any kind of online business. However, many people struggle by deciding on the correct outreach message they are going to send. And if you are one of them, this video is for you. My name is Seda BC and I'm the CEO and founder of Omnifusion AI and AutoIGDM. Since AutoIGDM has thousands of users who are automating their outreach on Instagram, I get at least 10 DMs every single day where people ask me what's the perfect first outreach message I can send so I actually get replies. And as it's becoming increasingly difficult for me to answer all of those DMs, I'm simply going to use the power of AI to solve that issue for all of you. I built a custom GPT on OpenAI's platform which is going to create your outreach messages for you. In the next few minutes, I'm going to show you how I actually created the custom GPT, which prompt we used, how you can use this GPT to create your outreach message. And in the end, I will also tell you how you can get access today for free to use this custom GPT to create your outreach messages for you. If you want to know three of the proven outreach messages that we are using in our business, click the video up here. And now let's jump right into it. It should not be the first time that you are seeing this screen because this is ChatGPT which we all know and love. To create a custom GPT you will need a plus membership and then you will need to go down on the left side, click on your profile and go to my GPTs. From here you will see all the GPTs you have created with that account and you will have the option to create a new GPT which we are going to do right now. Simply put, a GPT is a pre-prompted version of ChatGPT which has a specific use case. There is thousands of GPTs already in the GPT marketplace and today we're going to put a new one up there and I hope you will find it very useful for your next Instagram outreach campaign. So there's two options to create the custom GPT from here. First, the first option is we can configure everything on our own. You will give your custom GPT a name, you will give it a description and in the instructions this is actually where you're going to put the prompt for chat GPT and the instructions window is actually where we are going to put the prompt to tell ChatGPT what exactly it should do. The conversation starters are buttons in the ChatGPT window, which are pre-selected texts. And if users click on it, it's simply sending out that text, which is in that window. Here you can upload additional files as a knowledge base. For example, if you are building a support custom GPT or an FAQ custom GPT or anything related to that, where you need knowledge in the background. In our case, we don't need that, but you can do it here if you want to. Then you have a few choices of capabilities. You have web browsing, which should be clear. You have an image generator, which should be clear as well. And you have a code interpreter. The code interpreter simply means it can write scripts to analyze data. For example, you can upload Excel sheets and it is allowed to create and run code to filter some stuff or to mark things in different colors and things like that. And as a last option, we can also create actions for ChatGPT where it can run third party code, for example, and other things. It would go a bit too far for this video to explain you exactly what it does. If you want to know more about anything I just said, please go ahead in the comment section and leave me a comment. And if there's enough people interested in a specific topic, I'm going to create a much more sophisticated video around it. So that's that. As a last step, you're going to add a profile picture for the custom GPT. And that's option number one, how to create a custom GPT on OpenAI's ChatGPT platform. There's a second option, which is much simpler, but also way less quality from our experience. So we never use it. But if you go to the top and click on create, you will see a window similar to ChatGPT, which you know already. In this window, you can actually tell what you want your custom GPT to do and exactly what the use case is and the rules and everything around it. And ChatGPT is going to write the prompt for you, write the description and decide for a name. But ChatGPT is really, really bad in prompting. So this usually doesn't go well. So stick with the first option, configure. And this is where you can actually get really, really good results. And I'm going to show you our results in just a few seconds. To not make this video longer than necessary, I have already prepared everything we need. And I'm going to show you how exactly I built this custom GPT, which is going to write your cold outreach messages for you. First of all, we have a profile picture, which is the auto IGDM logo. Then we decided for a name, auto IGDM outreach script architect, which was also a suggestion from ChatGPT. We have a description. It crafts personalized outreach messages for Instagram cold DMs very straightforward. And I also added one conversation starter, which is help me to create my outreach message. We didn't upload any knowledge and we also don't need any of the capabilities down here and also no custom actions. And now I'm going to show you the key element which decides if a custom GPT is of good quality 
or not and that is actually the prompt i'm pretty sure you have already heard chat gpt is just as good as the guy who's prompting it and we have seen this also in this example i tried to create this custom gpt and the quality was only mediocre but thanks to my co-founder and head of product at omnifusion emil has helped me to create the correct prompt for this custom GPT so you will get the highest quality possible. Now I'm going to show you exactly how that script is structured and how Emil usually structures his scripts. This is still far away from any production deployment for any of our clients but for this experiment this is more than enough and it will help you to understand how scripts need to be structured so custom GPTs actually do what you want them to do. So to show you the full prompt we are just going to increase the size of this window and there you go i don't want to read all of this but you can see it here you can simply copy it and adjust it if you want to create your own custom gpt so this is all free and you can have the source from here if you can screenshot and copy the text simply tell me in the comments and i will provide you the link if you need the full prompt simply put a comment down below and i will send you the full prompt so you can use it and adjust it to your wishes in general we can say it's structured as follows first of all you have the context tell chat gpt what the context is what is the current environment it is working with in our case this is it's a gpt designed to create personalized compelling outreach messages for instagram dm campaigns blah 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 yada 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 these messages need to be in a specific format to be suitable for outreach using the auto igdm tool so the outreach messages you will receive from this custom gpt are already finalized in the right format to use it with auto igdm so you can simply copy and paste it and adjust some words and use it right away but if you are not using auto igdm to automate your instagram outreach you can still use this custom gpt it doesn't really make a difference you will still have your outreach message and you can still adjust it and you can always ask it to adjust the script for you with whatever preferences you might have i will show you how it works in a second the second step of a prompt is usually instructions what should it do and i'm not going to read all of it but we are telling it it's interacting with the users with us to understand our business our target audience and so on to get a full idea about the business before creating an outreach message because these outreach messages should be personalized to your business and to your target audience because this should work for all of you to save you tons of time and to also help you sell more on Instagram. The third step of the prompt are rules. So what rules does it need to adhere to deliver the results which we wanted to deliver? In this case, we told it that the messages need to be split into three different parts, which is the intro, the body and the outro. And for each part, we need three variations. As you might know, Auto IGDM makes unique messages for each individual outreach message. And this is how it works. And it will give you everything prepared so you can simply copy paste it into your Auto IGDM tool, click play and automate your outreach from there and as said if you're still doing manual outreach this will work for you anyway the last step of the prompt is actually an example so in this case we have used examples of how it should look like and one script example which i created just to give an idea to chat gpt what exactly the final message should look like and that's all of it and as said if you need that prompt hit the comments down below and I will send it to you. Okay, now we created the custom GPT, which we wanted. On the right side, we can now test it. Let's go ahead and do that together. Help me with my script. So we're starting the conversation with our custom GPT and it tells us what exactly it needs to know from us to create the outreach messages for us. In this case, he needs details about our business, our target audience, the goals we want to reach. Additionally, it also asks us for a specific tone or style. This is usually also known as your brand voice. Okay, so let's give it some information about our business. My business is Omnifusion AI. We are a custom AI automation agency for businesses in the coaching niche. We build AI chatbots to interact with potential leads on Instagram for all inbound messages. Our AI can qualify leads, nurture them and book appointments with qualified leads on autopilot. I want the tone to be professional and casual. This is obviously not 100% correct. We are not only targeting coaches or anything like that, but it is just for this example and it should work amazingly well. And as we can see, our custom GPT perfectly created three different outreach messages divided into intro body and outro each with three different variations and now comes the magical part and as you can see as well it also included custom variables like for example user first name if you are not using auto igdm you will not have this customization you can simply replace this with hey there or hey friend or hey coach 
whatever fits to your business. But if you use Auto IGDM, you can use custom variables and Auto IGDM is going to put in the first name of whoever you are going to text. We can now tell our custom GPT what we like and what we don't like and it's going to send us three new examples. And that's the magic. You don't need to love the first, you don't need to love the first suggestion of our custom GPT. You can ask it as many times to adjust the message as you want to get as many ideas and inspirations as you might need to create the perfect outreach message for your business. So now I'm going to show you what I mean by that. Okay, please implement more curiosity. And now it's going to take that advice from my side and create three new outreach messages as I want them. Hi, ever wondered about the future of coaching? Blah, blah, blah. Hey, curious about leveling up your coaching business? What's up, first name? Ready for a game changer in your inbox? Okay, okay, I already see it put emojis there. We don't like that. And for my taste, these outreach messages are a little bit too long. Let's see what it does after I give it new advice. Make them a bit shorter in total and don't use any emojis. And now it's going to create three new examples for us without emojis in a shorter frame and so on. You can make them longer, you can implement your offer. The opportunities are limitless and you can use this custom GPT anytime you don't have any inspiration or you don't know which outreach message to use just to get ideas and to craft a perfect outreach message for your business and for your campaign to use on Instagram called DMs. And by the way, if you got out any value out of this video so far, please do me a favor and hit the like button and subscribe to our channel because we're talking about this topic non-stop and it actually helps us to reach more people. Absolutely appreciate it. All right, so I am happy with the result. So we are now going to update this chat GPT. I already shared it. So if this is the first time you're sharing it, you can decide if nobody can see your GPT, just people with the link can see your GPT or if you want to publish it on the marketplace. This one I obviously published on the marketplace. So you all have access to it and you can use it right away. It's free, you can use it all day long and I hope it helps you create better and more different variations of your outreach message for your Instagram called Outreach. I hope this little fun project is going to help you in the future. And if you have any more questions, feel free to put them in the comments and I will try to answer all of them. If you didn't fully automate your Instagram outreach strategy yet, feel free to click the video somewhere at the top of the screen right now where I explain you exactly how you can automate your Instagram outreach from start to finish. This GPT will be available to all of you completely free of charge and I will put the link in the description so you can start right away and use it. Besides that, I want to thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one. Peace.